Welcome back to Purvika Prime News. Let's get started guys. The first Purvika Prime News. Facebook tie up with Saregama Inc licensing deal to let users add music to stories and videos. We have of course seen this kind of a feature on Instagram. This particular deal gives users the freedom to use it on posts as well as their stories on Facebook. These are songs that haven't been made available yet on these particular platforms. These are old Kishore Kumar songs, Rafi songs, Lata Mangeshkar songs and so many more. Guys, let us know about your favorite songs that are not yet available available on the Instagram stories and Facebook stories let us know down on the comment section because i surely have a lot of them and i can't wait to add some of that chaudhuri ka chand anyways now for the second news india unveils rupees 50000 crore schemes to attract electronics market and india is trying to bring in foreign investment by investing on manufacturing of electronics in india the guidelines as well has been unveiled by our union minister ravi shankar prasad Now for the third Purvika Prime news I'm going to call it the drone news and I'm going to split it up into three parts drone news 3.1 Swiggy Zomato Dunzo get permission to test drone delivery 34 applicants out of which 27 were turned down on the grounds of incomplete information 3.2 India permits to fly drones to combat locust attacks felt straight out of the movie locusts when we watched some of the videos combating locusts with drones great idea you know you don't have to physically be around and you can basically combat the locust attacks 3.3 Australian animal rescuers used drones with thermal camera to save wildlife. They had tested this earlier on during wildfire or the forest fires that spread across forests in Australia. They used this to save koala bears, kangaroos and what not. Prime news number 4. PlayStation 5 to launch in India on the same day as the international launch. But Delhi has hinted that the price of the PS5 would be significantly higher than it would have been in other places. They have been asked to concentrate on sales of PS4 at this point of time when the PS5 hits the market. Let's get to prime news number 5. Jio users get 1 year of Disney Plus and Hotstar VIP. This of course does not come to you as a surprise if you are a Jio user. We have been providing features like this for a while. At the moment the price is set to 3.99 per year, but we'll have to wait and see how they progress. Now on to prime news number 6. Google play to reinstate Mitro but not remove Chinese apps. Google decided that this is not ethical. Hence, they had to take down remove Chinese apps and keep it that way. But Mitro has a chance to come back. That is the news as of now. We shall keep you posted on that. On to prime news number 7. OnePlus 8 Pro will arrive in India with the X-ray filter disabled, also known as the color filter. The color filter was the one that was controversial, kind of felt like an X-ray camera that you would see at an airport. When it comes to India, it comes disabled. Let's get to prime news number 8. Indian bug bounty hunter gets a $100,000 from Apple for spotting a critical security bug. They paid a 27-year-old Indian developer Bhavuk Jain for spotting a vulnerability in sign-in with the Apple ID. The bug has been fixed right now. This definitely gives Bhavuk Jain a lot of street cred. Salute to you Bhavuk Jain. Prime news number 9. Leaf, the world's first UVC self-sterilizing smart mask. The Leaf comes in four sizes: 55 mm for kids of 3 to 8 years, 65 mm for kids of 7 to 12 years, 85 for adults or teens, and a huge 115 mm for adults with relatively larger face. Each Leaf mask comes with a HEPA filter and a carrying case costing $49, approximately rupees 3,700. Another one version comes with carbon filter and in turn has an $89 price tag campaign is on indiegogo you can go and check it out you can also go and contribute the link to that particular campaign will also be given down here just in case you guys wish to do so all right moving on purvika prime news number 10 atms in india testing touchless cash withdrawals using smartphones is actually a pretty good idea Purvika Prime News number 11 India is the least vulnerable to cyber crimes this isn't all that surprising it's only if you have an internet presence that you would actually be vulnerable to cyber crimes we have a fairly small minority of people who are avidly using the internet for various transactions but it's not so much accessible as of yet 
That is all for this week on Purvika Prime News. Make sure you subscribe to us, hit that like button and share. Let us know if we missed out on any news. You can drop down on the comments and let us know a news that went under our radar. And make sure to tune in this time next week. Thank you and bye bye.